Hello YouTube, hello MGTOW, hello Red Pill, this is Red Pill in the Wind. Now this is the topic of the video, but we're going we're gonna to delve into this one. You know it's funny, it's crazy that women expect me to believe that with all their intelligence they can't tell the difference between Robert Cradle Dirk, Robert Cradle Kelly and a reputable man. They can't, and, 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 and I find it insulting that they can't, that they expect us to believe that they can't tell the difference between Orenthal Johnson dirtbag and a decent man. But then again, hey, what do I know? You know, I'm, but this is the top, and we're going to move on to the topic. The topic of this video is why am I single? Now, the reason I'm single in the beginning was because I was too nice and I couldn't pick up on social cues. The reason I'm single now is because, well, not because I'm too nice, because my words come out like a sledgehammer and I don't pick up on social cues and I don't care about feelings. Let's talk about the external reasons. First off, let's start out with the external, work our way, work our way out, work our way in. Work our way in on the external visions. Basically, reason number one. The re answer number one I get when I try to date outside of my ra my, my race. Ingo wa Ingo wa Ingo in Ingo wa Hanaha Simonson. No hable inglés. That is two languages. Two languages. I butchered one of them. And to the language that I butchered, go menace. Now, that's pretty much what it is. But we're going to start out with the black, with the black, because I am black. Because I am black myself, so I, I gotta start out internally. I gotta start out within the hood, within the community. When I was young, I knew the pecking order based on I knew the pecking order based on hide and go get it. You know, I was the educated lame, the the the, the lame lame, the. Expletive, expletive, racial epithet. Well, they were dealing with Orenthal Johnson dirtbag. You know? You know, what they were dealing with those people. What they were dealing with Tyrone. What I was calling Tyrone. You know, while Big Tay Tay was in their guts. Heck, even the overweight ones, the ones that waddle when they walk like a penguin, got enough water in their body to put their feet, well, they got to get enough body fat to feed a freaking polar bear. Pre-diabetic, pre-stroke, pre-hypertensive, darn near heart attack ready. Oh, are you? Oh, 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 you were lame. I got called a lame. I got called a lame for my fair share. Just like everybody who's ousted from the black community, who's basically ousted from a black community at a young age, who wasn't basically one of that parties, was never invited to parties, was always told about the parties at, at after school. Or at school, in the morning school, in school. Oh, that party was lit. Oh, yeah, that's great. That's nice. That's nice that 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 y'all have a social group. And the party was lit. That's great. That I was relegated with nothing. Okay, great. Good for you. So basically, I was never, I was never a part of the freaking black community for a long, ever, community. 
my experiences with basically any other race, like white, if I could, if I went to a white race, I am either a fetish or I'm relegated to Miss Piggy. Last time I checked, I ain't Kermit the Frog, and I ain't green. I ain't Kermit the Frog, and I ain't green. Honestly, to be honest with you, I might as well been. Go to the, uh, to, I, I mean, I haven't, like I said, I haven't had much experience, I haven't had much interaction with the Hispanic community outside of a restaurant. You know? Or outside of boot camp. I haven't had experience, I haven't had much interaction with the, with, with, with the, with the Hispanic community, the Latino community, the Puerto Rican community, outside anything, any females. I didn't, like, literally, I didn't have that much interaction with them. Honestly. We haven't had, haven't had much interaction with, 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 with a Japanese, Chinese, Korean, Filipino. Other than already married couples. Other than un- already married couples. French already married, like n- nothing outside, nothing inside the U.S. If they if they weren't if they weren't a school teacher, I didn't have an interaction with them. It's almost like I had a freaking radar to where they all disappear. Track advice: Hey, this this person's nearby. Disappear, and and, and, and disappear and present your overweight. Leftovers. And present your overweight leftovers. So after a while, of getting hopes roller coastered, looking like looking like the stock, look like the like 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 the like the war post World War One stock market. Going on a roller coaster ride, crash into the ground, with my hopes. Or this current stock market looking like a jagged edge, jagged edge crash into the ground. Basically up, hopes up, knock back down. Hopes up a little bit more, a little less, knock back down. Hopes up a little less, knock back down. My hopes are in the freaking dumps. That is why, at this point, I'm not looking to date. I'm not looking to get married. Hell, I'm not even looking to get laid. I'm going to become the biggest braggart on YouTube. I'm going to become the biggest braggart on YouTube. Now, my problem. Look, you see? You see any rings on my finger? Nope. My hair, I, it, look, make fun. My hairline's called the retreat order. Going gray. Go ahead, make fun all you want. Hey, look, I, I'll help you. Your hairline's called the retreat order. You up here got gray beard. You look up, up here look like a gray beard. Trying to be looking down with that with that with that edgy shirt. Is that the best you got? Oh, look, you got your little Pennsylvania patch. You are nothing but a fat truck driver. Okay, so be it. So freaking be it. Oh, you four-eyed, you four-eyed educated, you four-eyed lame, you four-eyed Oreo, okay, whatever. Whatever. You just mad because you can't get laid, okay? No, you're mad, yeah, and you're mad because you can't get a, can't get a, can't get a, get or keep a man. You know? You're mad because you can't get or keep a man. You're mad because nobody wants to bail you out of your mess because you didn't let God dang on Long John Tay Tay paint your walls. <laughs> You're mad because I because ain't nobody gonna believe what you gotta say. I mean it's what it is. Hey look, 
But nobody tells you nobody tells you to go let the, to, to let Robert the Cradle Kelly paint your daughter's walls. Oh, is that is, 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 am I not supposed to say that? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. No, I'm not. <laughs> nobody told you to let Ornthal Ornthal Johnson the dirt bag. Take every take 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 give it give it to you in every one of your holes. You weren't objecting, that's for daggone sure. Ooh, I wasn't supposed to say that. You weren't you weren't screaming you weren't screaming harassment when 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 you were selling your tail in on the street corner. Ooh. He say that you weren't tell you weren't mad you weren't mad when when you was up here getting whenever you was up here making money on OnlyFans you're only mad because they ain't paying you no more because you passed your prime and you done took things bigger than most people's arms in some cases legs oh I'm sorry I wasn't supposed to mention the hot dog down the hallway oh they're classy women they're classy women and they're strong and independent and don't need no man. Well, that part's true. They don't need a man. They don't need a man. And they darn sure don't need me. They darn sure don't need me. They don't need no man and darn sure don't need me. So, I'm going to be the biggest braggart on YouTube. You see this? No ring. You see this? No ring. Last time I checked my wallet ain't got nobody's kids. I ain't gonna be nobody's stepdaddy. But what about Alexi? Oh, Alexi. <laughs> it was what? Legacy? <laughs> I ain't no legacy. See, the thing is, is like... Legacy is only meant for people who have children. Leaving behind a legacy. See, in order to leave behind a legacy, you have to have this thing called wealth. And the black com and the black community don't got it. And the black community don't got it. Because otherwise, they'd be passing down the house to generation to generation. If the black if the black community had wealth had wealth to pass down. They'd be able to just buy the house across across the street, across the way, yonder. If the black community had wealth. Buy up whole neighborhoods with their family. If the black community again had wealth. You wouldn't see all somebody got that going to dilapidated houses in the black in the, in the community. The black community had wealth. You wouldn't be seeing, I mean, you wouldn't be seeing so many single mothers. You wouldn't be seeing so many illegitimate children running around on the street after the street lights come on. Growing their boldness, harassing people that are basically coming home from work late at night. If the black community had wealth. People wouldn't be getting robbed on the street. People wouldn't be getting their chain snatched, getting slapped, getting getting beat, banged outside the head for they for their wallet and their and their jewelry. The black community had wealth. Like I said, I'm single for my own reasons. I'm single for my own shack ups, and I'm single because well, there's no point in trying anymore. Am I bitter? No. Because I know there's not a daggone thing that, that I can do about it. And you ladies are not going to do a daggone thing to fix it. Because y'all go... Because this is what it is. You're going to complain about the incels. But you're not going to do anything to stop it. Hold on, let me say that. Let me show you my face. Let me show you my eyes. You're going to... You're all... You ladies all complain about all the incel, the, the incel problem, the incel problem, yada, yada, yada. But you don't do nothing to fix it. You, ladies, you, ladies, have everything to do to fix it. But you don't. Women outnumber men by a significant amount, but you only go after the 5%. You only, 
You don't look at the rest of the 95% of men. You look at the five. You look at the five percent. Says, "Oh, I want that." You know. But when you don't, when you can't get that like, when you can't keep that lifestyle, oh, well, now you're gonna settle with the ninety percent. Ninety percent. Guess what? Your 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 your, your numbers are your numbers are uh, dropping pretty soon on on the men you can you can get. It's nice to have a soda every once in a while. You are going to sit there and complain and complain and complain and you're not going to do anything about it. It is what it is. But you go, girl. You go, girl. You strong. You independent. And you don't need no man. Okay, I, I want you to keep that same energy when you're, on, when, when, when you're at margarita night salinizing your margaritas and water, salinizing and watering down your, your margaritas. With your tears. Right around closing time. Right around last call. But. What do I know? This is Red Pill in the Wind. You lady, you ladies continue on with your with your business. You continue sleeping with, 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 with John Bonet Loser. It's not like I know anything, but you you go ahead and go out there and play with your cousin. Red Pill in the Wind signing off.